Hello students, today we will discuss the chapter number 3 more about internet. In this lesson we will learn about printing a web page, printing selection from a web page, copying text and images from a web page, wireless internet access point, global positioning system. So introduction. Earlier we use access the web using the fixed line service. Nowadays the internet is becoming more accessible as it can be accessed on the portable device like the mobile phones and tablet and computers. Internet. Internet means the networks of network we have studied about the internet in the earlier classes it's time for a quick recap the term blog is a shorthand for so answer is a web log voip stands for so voice over internet protocol for online conferencing, the hardware requirements are microphone, speaker and PC with camera or the laptop with camera. Google's blank space is a popular email program. So its answer is the Gmail. So Google's Gmail is a popular email program. A blank space is a website where the entries are made in a diary or general style. So its answer is the search engine like the Google or the Yahoo. These are the search engines. So you see the answer and note it in your book or the copy. The term blog is the shorthand for web blog. VOIP stands for voice over internet protocols. For online conferencing, the hardware requirements are the microphone, microphone, speakers and laptop with camera. Okay, and the Google's Gmail is a popular email program. Pip a blank space to so search engine is a website where entries are made in a diary or the general style. Now the printing the web page being viewed. Clear. So to take a printout of the web page we follow these steps number one go to the file menu step one go to file on the menu bar and click print a print dialog box appears. So you see the file and print. Then the dialog box will appear. See, this is the dialog box of the print. This one. Here you select the all page ranges and click on the print. Okay. So click the print. So now we perform this task on the internet. So I am going to the internet. This is the Google. And suppose I want to take out of this web page. Then what is the method? You see th there are the three dots. You click on it. Then you will see the print option. 
you click on it another option is the control plus p so you press the control and the p then the dialog box of the print will appear on the screen and this dialog box is showing that there are the three sheets of the paper means that there are the three web pages and after that you select the all from the pages portrait from the layout and the color from the color and finally you click on the print option then these three pages will be printed on the printer now we come back to the page number one printing a selection from a web page means that we want to select the matter and after that we want to take out the printout of this printed matter how to perform this task steps are given here so to print a selected portion of the web page we follow the step given below select the text we want to print go to the file menu and click the print in the page range select page range section of the print dialog box click the radio button next to selection and the click prints so now we perform it this is the website okay and you want to print this matter so you first you select the matter i am selecting the matter matter has been selected after that you move your pointer on these three dots click on it and choose the option print dialog box will appear now you choose the option selection first you select the matter after that you move your pointer on the selected matter now right click the mouse and click on the print option dialog box of the print will appear and after that you click on the print option then only the selected matter will be the printed come back to the page number 2 copying from a web page to copy a text from the web page we follow these steps first select the text to be copied place the mouse pointer within the selected text and right click a menu appears this one and select the copy from the menu this option copy option then
step 4 go to the document step 4 go to the document where we want to paste the copy text right click and select paste from the menu so now we perform it go to the by juice now select the matter so i am selecting the matter download air class ncrt book pdf okay now move your pointer on the written matter or the selected matter and the right click and choose the option the copy after that you open any word processing software wordpad or the ms word or the notepad i am opening notepad so my notepad has been opened now once again right click the mouse and choose the option the paste my selected matter has been pasted in the notepad after that i can take out the printout of this selected matter now once again we come back to the page number three now copy a picture or a graphic from a web page we follow these steps place the mouse pointer on the image second right click and select the save picture as from the menu that appears so you see this is a save as picture in the save as dialog box locate the folder where the file has to be saved and give the appropriate file name and click on the ok so we perform it see this is a web page and there are the so many images are given there these are the antivirus softwares so select any image i select the image the norton after that first you move your pointer on the image after that you right click the mouse and move your pointer on the save image as save image as and click on it then the dialog box of of the save as will appear after that you select the folder where you want to paste or the store this image the by default the name of this file is the shopping one png so i am not changing the name of the file and click on the save my file has been saved now open the file explorer or the window explorer here the name of the folder is the pictures you select the folder picture after that you see the shopping one png my uh, the image has been saved under the folder picture now you can view it how double click on it then this image will appear in the photoshop this is your photo which is saved by us now once again we come back to the page number three internet on the mobile device these days 
more and more people are using the internet on mobile device like the laptops mobile phones etc these users connect to other computers wirelessly using usually through a internet so everybody is aware about the internet on the mobile device but you can also connect your your laptop your pcs from the mobile phone for example at this time my laptop is connected from the mobile phone and for what for connecting my laptop to the internet so wireless internet access point wireless is a term used to describe telecommunication in which waves carry the signal over the part or the entire communication path there is a one picture is given you see that this is called the wireless modem and this wireless modem actually receive the signal as well as sending the signal to the connecting devices here the laptops and the mobile phones are connected with this device that is called the wireless modem now these device can receive the data or the send the data through the wireless modem and connect these uh, and connect devices to the internet at home in offices in airport people connect wirelessly to the internet through the wireless internet access point using the notebook computers smartphone and the other mobile devices a wireless internet access point is a station so this is a station that transmit and receive the data wireless modem these days many mobile users use a wireless modem it uses the cell phone network to connect to the internet wirelessly from a laptop or the other mobile devices wireless modems look like a pen drives this is a pen this is a wireless modem but look like a pen drive so wireless modem communicate with the wireless internet access provider and wireless modem inserted in a notebook computers so it means that the wireless modem can be inserted into the mobile phone here you will see here the usb port uh, there you can insert your wireless modem you can see that at this time my computer is connected to the geoni f103 pro means i am i am accessing the internet from the geoni f103 pro okay so i can connect and that disconnected also from my computer system gps or the global positioning system a global positioning system is a navigation system that consists 
of the earth with receiver which accepts signals sent by the satellites to know the geographical location of the receiver a gps receiver is a handheld device that has a receiver and a screen that shows the receiver position these days the many mobile phones have the gps capability the gps facility lets the user know where the user is currently located the data obtained from the gps system can be used to know many <coughs> other things like the map route between the two points locating a lost person or the stolen object etc in next class we will learn the online testing online news online encyclopedia and cloud computing so thank you very much for watching my tutorial thank you very much